So next up we have Shayna Baszler versus Becky Lynch. A match I'm really looking forward to, actually. Um, I really like the look of this Shayna Baszler. She really does look something like ruthless. And Becky Lynch has held the title a year now, so I think her title reign ending now would be be a good time to pass on to someone like Baszler, who's never had an opportunity at one of the main roster titles. Of course, very good in NXT, but as have many people before her and not quite succeeded on the main roster. But, I mean, obviously, Becky Lynch won the main event of WrestleMania last year in controversial fashion, of course, with that weirdly went-wrong roll-up on Ronda Rousey. But Becky Lynch has been champion for a year and certainly can't argue with the, you know, the momentum she's built in a year, really. I mean, bar the power couple thing with Seth, which I think... Yeah, that wasn't great in my opinion, but she she's done very well and she's still got a lot of momentum. She just did a really cool entrance, actually, outside. She came in in, like, some truck with the man written on it, and, yeah, it was it was quite cool. And one thing I didn't mention earlier, by the way, was fair place to WWE for how they have built up this show, and in the circumstances, it would have been very easy for them to cancel, and they, they haven't done that. They've, you know, they've really gone ahead with it and they've really tried their best to put on a show for the fans and everyone watching at home hopefully is having a good time watching it and so far i've pretty enjoyed the two matches so but i think we should be kicking it up a gear with this match here i mean i'm actually quite surprised this match is on night one i thought they would put it on night two but it's probably going to be charlotte versus um rhea ripley instead which i'm not complaining about Seeing Charlotte, the winner of the Royal Rumble, go for the NXT title is, is going to be interesting because uh, it's something I'd really like to see. Wait. And of course, you have the Fatal Five Way tomorrow night for Bailey's title as well. I'm going to go for a Shayna Baszler win here. I really think it's the time to put the belt on her. And the fact we've had no heel wins so far, we've had two babyface victories. And Becky's had a great run, run with the championship a year, so you certainly can't, couldn't argue if she lost it tonight. I mean, this time last year, I actually predicted Becky to face Ronda again. I thought Rousey would come back to the company, but no, she only spent a solitary year in the company and then... Um, not been seen since last year's WrestleMania, despite the controversial ending. Of course, Baszler got this opportunity by eliminating every single woman in the Elimination Chamber match. Very impressive. She looked great in that match as well. But here we go. It starts off with a brutal grappling. This match has actually got a different commentary team, by the way. It's um, Tom Phillips and Byron Saxton, I believe. Well, Spazer already went for the Carabona clutch, but that's countered by Becky, who is chased to the outside. It is Phillips and Byron, just to clarify. Is Baszler going to work? I was actually thinking in this match, could Baszler like squash Becky? Because that would be quite something. <laughs> oh God, Baszler on the outside going for a power bomb. Oh, a Lynch counters with a Hurricane Runner. Baszler briefly glanced at the table. She might have been planning on putting Becky through the announce table. Oh. A lot of work been done on the outside in this match, actually. Um, as Becky gets in to break up the count at seven. But, and Becky throws Baszler into the steel steps. You can really tell Becky just wants to feed off the crowd, but she can't. <laughs> Baszler tossed back into the ring by Becky. Who's heading up to the top rope. Go for a drop kick off the top rope by Becky. Baszler wisely rolling out of the way to prevent a cover. Becky going for the run. 
takes down Bays taking out Baszler. Becky in control of the match at the moment. Yeah. I think Becky Lynch deserved a push in the company much earlier than she got it. I mean, remember she was treading water for a couple of years, really not doing much relevant. And it really took until she turned heel to really get a good push. And then she was instantly returned face due to how popular she was. Ooh. Oh, nice counter there from Baszler. Catching Becky with a kick to the face. We'll go now for the move here. Oh, counter by Becky going for the disarmer. Maybe disarmer. she gonna? No, counter by Baszler. Cut the clutch. Roll up by Becky. One, two. Shades of last year, how she won the title. Oh, a spy buster by Baszler. I don't know how long this match is going to go. It's, I think this match just could be an absolute war. Oh, Baszler going for it again here. Oh, nice move from Baszler. Into the cover, one, two. Kick out by Lynch. I thought she had it for a second. Becky's staying in it. Baszler just looks scary. Like, sets her up. Oh, went missed it. Becky again going for the disarmer. Can she? No, good counter by Baszler. Oh, Lynch with a nice kick as well. Both women outside on the apron as Baszler counters, as does Lynch. This ain't gonna end now. This ain't gonna end well. Oh. Right. A couple of right hands and left. And Baszler. Oh. Oh, nice move from Becky. It's like a rock bottom on the apron there from Be from Becky. And she's put Baszler's put back in the ring. Becky with the cover. One, two. Oh, kick out by Baszler. Say if that pinned her, I'd have been very disappointed. <laughs> yeah, Becky looks very frustrated at the moment. She has not put her away. Yeah, Baszler looks pretty out of it at the moment. I think Becky is starting all. Becky's going to go up the top now, maybe. She is. Oh, nice counter. From Baszler. He throws Becky down. Oh, Baszler. Great move into the armbar. Oh, Lynch in trouble. It's an arm breaker. But Becky manages to counter. Rolling through. Oh, Becky got a roll up, but Baszler again, disarm her. With Becky's own move, could she make Becky tap? No, Becky's going to break it. Nice roll through. Again, good counter. Oh, what a kick. Baszler, one, two. Becky kicks out with two. Thought that was it for a second again. A few near falls in this match for the challenger. That kick lock in the killed Becky. Oh, oh, Becky counters, hanging up Baszler on the top rope. And Becky, go, oh, she's going to go for a disarmer? She's kind of gone for it on the rope. She'll get, she went, yeah, she can't hold it. Oh, and going for the, the Caravona clutch, but it's on the rope. Oh, oh, she had it locked in on the rope, so she had to break the hold at four, of course.
both men out, bo both men, both women going to the outside of the ring now. I'm maybe thinking an announce table might go through in this match. They've teased it a few times. Oh, going for the power bomb again. Uh oh. Oh. She like ragdolled her into the announce table twice. Thought she was going to power bomb her through it originally, but a ragdoll. Baszler getting in the ring to break up the count. Baszler's smiling at what she's just done. It's like the Brock Lesnar of the women's division. And Baszler puts Becky back in the ring. Ooh, going for the disarmer, Becky. Counter. No, Baszler's countered again. Oh, we'll go for the car Caravana Clutch. Becky doing her best to fight out of it, though. She's got... No, she hasn't got to the ropes. Oh, Becky could be in trouble. She's got it. Oh, no, she's rolled through. One, two, three. Becky's won. Becky wins via a roll-up. Another babyface win, a third in a row. Not the result I expected. And to be honest, I think that... I mean, I really like Becky Lynch, of course, but that could be the wrong result. We've seen that happen to Samoa Joe's Coquina clutch plenty of times, and exactly the same there with Shayna Baszler's... Car Sorry, I forgot what it's called. But, yeah, <laughs> another babyface victory on this very babyface-friendly night so far. But Becky Lynch is still the women's champion, and her reign is now going to surpass a year long. But yeah, that was a pretty good match. Actually, wasn't surprisingly given as long as I thought it would, but not too bad at all. But I'm disappointed Baszler didn't win, I must say.